Bienvenidos, good morning to my viewers here in Vermont and around the world. Many blessings to all of you. Today, I brought the word to the people, the people of God and those who do not know God. The word today was from the book of Job, the book of wisdom, the wisdom of God. And then from the book of Psalm, the book of Psalm 107, 1 to 3 and 23 to 32. Here was Job that finally acknowledged Jehovah, Jehovah's wisdom. By wisdom, God created all things. But Job had three friends. And that time they were into philosophy, psychological things. And if you've done anything wrong, you were violating God. And they didn't even understand. That at the end, Jehovah God blessed him. But he blessed Job once he recognized the power and the wisdom and the beauty of God. David in the book of Psalm 104 describes God's mighty. Jesus Christ described to his disciples because during that time, in the Hebrew time, they rely on philosophies and they relied, if you have done something wrong, it's because God was punishing you. But when the disciples said to Jesus, who have sinned in their family, that this man is blind? And Jesus says, no. It's so that God will glorify himself. The same way when Satan, he was one of the council, heavenly council, which Jehovah God created Satan, which his name is adversary in Hebrew. And he challenged Jehovah about the faithfulness of Job. In spite of it all, he even asked to be killed and die. But he never, not one word out of his tongue, cursed God what he was going through his torment. But his three friends, little did they knew that the things that they were saying to Job was not correct, but Job spoke correctly. So my question was, are you relying on another human being philosophy or the AI, GPT? Are you relying on God? Because God knows why all these things are happening around the world. Jesus told us. That was my question. Job continued with his faith in spite of what they going, what he was going through. And many of us are suffering around the world. And our life has been saved. And some have perished. But God wants us to continue in believing in him. So the question was, are you holding on to your faith when disaster occurs? Are you relying on AI or some other philosophers? Or on Jesus Christ? God bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen.